Welcome back, everyone. Can anyone take on the six degrees of chasers? <laughs> right. Please join me, Jim from Glasgow. Where's Jim? Where's Jim? <laughs> Okay, what do you do for a living? Uh, I'm an accountant, uh, but I work for a whiskey company. Oh, you do? I do indeed, yeah, I do indeed. Fantastic, I love that. Okay, <laughs> did you bring any drink with you? None for you, unfortunately, but uh, no. <laughs> what, what is the point of yeah. that? Okay, I've oh, got any hobbies? Uh, yes, I like barbecuing. Yep. In Scotland? In Scotland, yeah. How many days do you do that? Maybe uh, half a day? Yeah. In, in, in a year? Barbecuing. <laughs> <laughs> what else do you like doing? Uh, yes, yeah, so I've got four barbecues, so... Um, oh, well, that's well, up, of course, yeah. Takes, up, takes oh, up a lot of time. That's sensational. Two arms, four barbecues. Why not? <laughs> yeah, yeah. OK, if you win some money today, what are you going to buy? Another barbecue? Uh, <laughs> hoping to uh, go to Norway, do some kayaking in the fjords, if we win some money. OK, all right, very good. Have you been to Norway before? Uh, only with work, so a uh, chance to go on holiday would be lovely. So you have been to Norway before, then? I have, yeah. <laughs> only with work. Doesn't count. It's not the same. <laughs> only with work? Stop yeah. being so fake. Have you been to Norway or haven't you? <laughs> <laughs> yes, I have. OK. Was it with work? It was, yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's not really going to Norway, that should go on a holiday. <laughs> OK. You're going to need some money, right, to take on the chasers. You know how it works. Are you ready? I'm ready. I wish you luck, Jim. Let's play. <laughs> Here's your first question. Good luck. In the opening lyrics to Dolly Parton's song, Nine to Five, she pours herself a cup of what? A, tradition. B, suspicion. Or C, ambition. It's ambition. You're saying C, ambition? Yep. Is that the right answer? It is thousand pounds that reverse. <laughs> Great Dolly Parton. Here's thousand pounds straight away, so we know we're taking on the chasers anyway. That's very good. Here's your next question. Good luck. In Greek myth, Aphrodite is the goddess of what? A. Night. B. Love. C. Wisdom. Uh, she's a goddess of love. Goddess of love. Is that the correct answer? It is very good. <laughs> Two thousand pounds. Okay. Here's the next question. The fragrance Star Wars Galaxy is advertised as having captured the core characteristics of what? A, the Death Star. B, the Stormtrooper. Or C, the Wookiee. Wow. That's tricky. Uh, go with Stormtrooper? I would think the smelly one out of a lot of them would be the Wookiee. I don't know. I might be wrong. What do you reckon, Stormtrooper? Wookiee? Yeah. You reckon Wookiee? Wookiee? Yeah. Are you going to join in or sit there? <laughs> Line himself up. Wake her up, for God's sake. Pull yourself <laughs> up. What do you think, the Wookiee? Yeah. Well, we're back in the game. <laughs> You're going with Stormtrooper. Is that the correct answer? It is Stormtrooper. <laughs> You're playing well. Yeah, it's very good. good. I wonder why the Stormtrooper are not Wookiee. Vixen. You wouldn't want to smell like a Wookiee. <laughs> would you? I visited Wookiee Hole once. It was a very disturbing experience. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. Here's your next question. Three grand. <laughs> Sergei Gorshkov won the Wildlife Photographer of the Year Award in 2020 for his picture of what? A. Tiger hugging a tree. B. Bear licking a beehive. Or C. Python kissing a beaver. <laughs> it's good to be back, right, Jim? <laughs> Yeah. It may be the wrong answer, but I desperately want you to say C. <laughs> OK, what do you reckon it I, is, Jim? I desperately want to say C as well, but I think, I don't know, uh, B, the bear and the beehive. Not a python kissing a beaver? Which is a lovely photograph, I understand. I've seen it many, many times. <laughs> is that the right answer? No. OK, correct answer is... 
Yeah, shame. Yeah, tiger hugging a tree. Nonetheless, three grand. You're not taking on all six, but that doesn't matter. There's no super offer at the moment, but you're taking on possibly five chases. Should we see where we go with that? Yeah. Three grand is now time to face the chasers. <laughs> Jim, this is a quick fire head to head against the chasers. You get 60 seconds on your clock, they get 60 seconds on their clock. Now, the chasers will offer you a time advantage and money. Based on those offers, you choose how many chasers you wish to face. Now, if you want to play for the £3,000 you got in the cash builder, you automatically take on two chasers, and those two chasers are it's the Cinnaman and Super Nerd. Cinnaman. Well, Jim, I've not quite worked you out yet. Not least, are you really tall or you just stood next to Bradley? <laughs> <laughs> it's true. It's true. But fair. Yeah. <laughs> right, super nerd. Time then, please. We would like 38 seconds on our clock for your £3,000. Yeah. Oh, 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 they're getting involved. Oh, they think they're I getting can. involved early, aren't they? <laughs> I like it. OK, let's have a look at your next offer then. You're taking on three chasers. This is the third chaser, please. All right, we have the Vixen. Go ahead. We want 40 seconds on our clock. You'll be playing for £10,000. <laughs> audience like that. The audience like that. OK. Let's have a look. Who's the fourth chaser, please? It is the Menace. Well, Jim, Norway's expensive, and we want to make sure you can afford your trip. Oh. Oh. Yeah. yeah, hysterical. <laughs> he makes me laugh. He's a laugh a month, he really is. <laughs> We want 44 seconds on our clock. For that, you'll be playing for £30,000. <laughs> 16-second time advantage there. All right, who will be the fifth chaser? <laughs> OK, fifth chaser is the Beast. Beastie Boy offers, please, thank you. We want 46 seconds on our clock, and you'll be playing for £75,000. <laughs> Talk me through it. What do you think? Top offers a huge amount of money. Uh, my wife's last advice to me before I left was don't be greedy. So I'm going to play four chasers. You're taking on four chasers. £30,000. 16 second time advances. All right, here we go then. Jim, you ready? I'm ready. It's time to see if you can beat the chasers. You know the rules. Jim, you ready? I'm ready. Your clock starts counting down now. Where on the body is a sunbonnet worn? The head. Correct, Chasers. Pikachu's a character in what suit? Pokemon. Correct. Jim, Mussolini was killed during what war? Second World War. Correct, Chasers. Which former Taui star runs the fitness site for nutrition? Jenny. Pass. It's Fern McCann. Director Peter Jackson is from what country? Jenny. New Zealand. Correct. Jim, in the US, a ballpark is a venue for what sport? Baseball. Correct. Chasers, steps is a traditional bingo call for what number? Paul. 39. Correct. Jim, the C organisation is a strict order of what religion? It's Scientology. Correct. Chasers, who composed the orchestral suite, The Planets? Dara. Holst. Correct. Jim, who plays the title character in the 2021 film Black Widow? Uh, uh... Uh, Natasha Romanoff. Scarlett Johansson. The alligator is native to Asia and what other continent? Uh, America. I need a bit more. North America. Correct. Chasers, Mrs. T was a nickname for which politician? Oh. Margaret Thatcher. Correct. Jim, Blackwood and Gerber are bids in what card game? Uh, bridge. Correct. Chasers, what palace in Norse myth has over 500 doors? Isa. Asgard. It's Valhalla. Oh, what does the S stand for in the food additive MSG? Oh. Sodium. Correct. Jim, the Atacama Desert is in what country? Mongolia. Chile. Jason X is a film in what horror franchise? Uh, Friday the 13th. Correct. Chasers, what would you do if you were asked to take a pew? Paul. Sit down. Correct. Jim, which architect designed the Walt Disney Concert Hall? Uh, pass. Frank Geary. Godzilla originated in what country? Japan. Correct. Chasers. Down. Right. Cheese. It's a big <laughs> set <laughs> OK, great choice, taking on the four. Brilliant choice, £30,000 kayaking in Norway. Brilliant. Uh, yeah, Cinnamon, how did he do? Uh, he did absolutely brilliant. He deserves every penny. Because Isa. So 
Sorry. sorry. <laughs> All right. I was leaning. Sorry, sorry. It's a long way up here. <laughs> Super nerd. <laughs> Boomerang, I sent him straight back. <laughs> right, here we go. Paul, you were saying before you were so rudely interrupted. <laughs> Um, well, he did absolutely brilliantly there, because in the middle of that, he pulled out a superb answer on the pressure with the Scientology answer. Yeah. yeah. It was yeah. probably the crux of the whole game, because that was a great answer on the pressure. Listen, fantastic job, Jim. Off you go back to Glasgow, £30,000, and Norway, here you come. Give it up for Jim, everyone. Thank you very much. Brilliant, Jim. Well done, Jim. Well done. Well done, Jim.